<laughs> hey, Mr. Putin. Hey, Mr. Putin, you should come visit me. Hi, Mr. Putin. Hey, Mr. Putin. Hi, Mr. Putin. Hey, Mr. Putin, can you do this? Look, Mr. Putin, I have a Putin doll. I think it was really bad that Russians banned adoption. Russia slams the door. It affects so many Americans hoping to adopt. Families now wondering if they'll ever get to see that child again. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Hi, my name is Daria, and I was adopted from Russia 10 years ago. My name is Paris, and I'm adopted from Russia. I was adopted from Russia three and a half years ago. Nine years ago. I was adopted from Russia. I was adopted seven years ago. I was adopted 10 years ago. I was adopted from Russia 20 years ago. It's pretty cool that I was adopted from Russia. This is my Russian tortoise, and his name is Max. Hey, Mr. Putin, do you know how to play t-ball? I played t-ball today, and I got free hits. Mr. Putin, do you have any pets? I love my dog. I went on a um, Disney cruise once with a bunch of kids fr that are adopted from Russia, and they were all girls, which was really annoying for me. <laughs> My name is Tatiana, and I'm seven, and I am adopted from Russia. I had a problem with my bones, and then they had to build me a whole new leg because my bones weren't working. When we brought her here, it was a matter of months before she had a new leg and was walking. My family loves me because it's not just my leg, it's what you are. You don't have to be the same. My name is Katya and I'm a state champion. My favorite thing to do is gymnastics. I've been doing gymnastics for eight years. I went to state championships and I went on uneven bars and I won first place. These are the medals that I won at the state championship. Institutions can give children a lot of the things they need, like food and medicine, but there are two things that only the family can give, and that's love and that's hope. I went to Russia, I met my child, and now I can't bring her home. When I first saw her, where we really connected, she was sitting in my lap and she sat with her legs wrapped around my waist and put her hands on my cheeks. It's heartbreaking because I think that Oksana probably is wondering where I am. It seems very senseless. Hey, Mr. Poon, you should let the adoption start again. Adoption's great. You get to be with a nice family, and you get to have nice food, and you get to have a nice bed. We're doing great over here. <laughs> Mr. Putin, come on over, I'll show you. We're doing fine. Kids like me get really nice families. And you should come over here, I'll let you play with my Putin doll. Hey, Mr. Putin, do you want to go shoot some hoops or something like that? <laughs> Please, Mr. Putin. Mr. Putin, come on. Just, you know, change your mind. Allow the kids to come over. Please, Mr. Putin. If you come, Mr. Putin, I'll teach you how to throw a softball. You know, I've thought a lot about Katya's birth mother and how much I appreciate that she gave this child a life, and I will always thank her for letting her come. I wish that all Russians could know how much I love Katya. Will you please let the children come over here? Come on, Mr. Putin. Come on, Mr. Putin. Give them a break. You know, let's adopt a new attitude. Adopt a new attitude. A new point of view. Let's adopt. Let's adopt. Let's adopt. Let's adopt.